LA has seen some destructive winds culminating in numerous wildfires. And the big question, could something like this happen in Northern California? And the answer is it can and it has before. So let's talk about the science, why we're seeing these very strong winds across parts of the state. It's called a strong pressure gradient. And what that means, we have an area of low pressure currently over the Baja Peninsula and high pressure close by. These two are opposing forces and what they do when they get close to each other, they create this wind tunnel and the placement of these two systems currently has the strongest winds over Southern California. If this high pressure were just a little bit more to the north, that wind corridor would be essentially over the Bay Area. Now, depending on where we are in the state, the offshore winds get different names across Southern California. These devastating winds get the name Santa Ana winds. When they occur across Northern California, they get the name Diablo wind. So that's the setup we have seen before. And what is actually happening, we have these really strong winds racing across our ridge tops, racing across the surface at times more than 80 miles per hour. And there's a lot of cold air up here. And cold air is very dense. And what happens, that cold air sinks to the surface. We call this subsidence. And when it sinks, it drags these really fast winds up above down to the surface. And as they race down the hillsides and the mountains, they speed up even more and those winds can run in excess of 60, 70, 80 miles per hour across Southern California. We saw these winds close to 100 miles per hour here locally in the Bay Area. We have seen this exact setup before back in 2017, the North Bay wildfires. We were experiencing an extreme Diablo wind event. That's when we saw frequent winds gusting 60, 70, 80 miles per hour, and those winds ignited six major wildfires among them. The Tubbs fire, the Nun fire and the Atlas fire. At that time, this was the costliest group of wildfires coming in more than $14 billion.